here's the new Loretto Sports Bar. Not quite opened yet. Right next to the Palm Tree Resort. They've started painting the outside. It's an upstairs bar. Downstairs there's a drive-in uh, garage. Utility building down below. And it looks like they're about ready to open up. This is a business closing I'm disappointed about. Lava on the beach, right across from Angel's Bakery. I like the place. I'd go there a couple times a month. Nice sitting down by the beach. It used to be the German Beach Bar. They went out of business also. It's just one of those things where there's just more bars more businesses than there are people to support so somebody suffers and in a case like this when they were new and not established they are the ones who suffered and they went out of business standing out in front of the wet spot bar of the maze and this is not too far away from the geographical middle of the business district here in Barreto but in a few months this will be the business center for sure when both of these hotels are open the uh, by the sea extension that you're looking at right there and the um, large Central Park Reef Hotel. This is really going to be something when that's built, and it will be the centerpiece of town. Obviously, everyone will be describing other businesses' locations based on where this hotel is, because everybody will know where this hotel is, even if you've been here only one time. But they are about six months or longer away from completion. I look forward to the opening of this hotel. The Aloha Bar, right across from Rico's, just down the street from the new Central Park Hotel. I'm already using that hotel as a landmark. It's very close. It's right next to By the Sea. This Aloha Bar is the most famous non-open bar in Barreto. It's been anticipated opening for several months, and it looked like it was ready to open two or three months ago, and it hasn't, maybe due to waiting for the new year and getting permits, I don't know. But I did hear today, this morning, that it's gonna open soon, in a couple of weeks maybe. But for sure, the restaurant down below called Foodies, it's a takeout restaurant, for sure it will open tomorrow. So very soon, both Foodies and the Aloha Bar will be open. To give a perspective of those people who have not been to Barreto, I'm standing at the future main intersection the intersection that has the new By the Sea Hotel going in, the addition, and the Central Park Hotel, and the maze of five bars, Lollipop, Wet Spot, Rum Jungle, etc. Rico's Restaurant, Rico's is a popular restaurant here, and then looking down the street is the Benito Hotel. That's a good hotel for people wanting something nice, but inexpensive. And the location is great. But the future of Barreto is right at this intersection.